What is going on, X community? It's Exostomp here, and today, people. Well, we're a little late. We're probably like two, two and a half weeks late. Um, the reason being, I tried to. Uh, I'm trying to figure out how to stop this error from happening while I was trying to um, upload the video. For some reason, there's an error in the video, so. Uh, I can't use them, sadly. Um, but we can still go over the replay real quick. Um, I don't know if I actually have the team still because it was a while ago. And I thought it would upload and it did not. So, uh, we can just go over the, the game, I guess, real quick. Let's see what I remember. Um, well... I brought the spear tomb for the hitman top. I think the Moltres was offensive. Uh, you know, I can't remember much, but um, we did bring a Thwacky over the Toxtricity. The main reason was because uh, I wanted to use I wanted to use it more in this draft, and I really wasn't able to. It wasn't many. Um, it wasn't many ways that I could really use it effectively so i want i just wanted to use that for the last week i only used it i think once so i wanted to use it again um and yeah so there was a rotom rotom was for uh toxicity anyways i was tempted to bring like a throat chop set for the rotom like an offensive uh shift gear fire punch throat chop and then like wild charge set or something which actually wouldn't have been bad here. Uh, actually, it wouldn't have been bad at all. But I did not bring it, sadly. Um, I, I had to choose the other five Pokemon. And then Thwack, you had to say. But, uh, yeah. Let's just get into it real quick. Uh, I don't want to take too long for this. Because it already happened. I doubt people really care at this point. Because uh, it was a while ago. But, yeah. Let's just play it. Uh, I'll play it in slow. So, start with Thwacky. Uh, we can't stay in here, so we switch out right into Swampert. As a knockoff happens, I find out that it's Choice Banded, so I'm like, oh, okay. So uh, I have to go into Umbreon here, because it's the only way I could really take it. Uh, good play, though. I, I like the Choice Banded in Center so it's cool. Uh, so here, I believe I just press Baton Pass if I have it, um, which I do. And I go right out in the Moltres. Free, free fire move here. Uh, Slow King comes out. What do I do? I click U-turn. That was smart of me. Okay. Go into Thwacky again. Uh, I should U-turn again. I go for knockoff. I guess that's not a bad move either. Go into Spear Tomb and goes for Toxic. Good play, good play. Uh, yeah, I really don't remember much about this game. Uh, Tsunar, yep. Tsunar is a good choice here, but then I go around in the Moltres here and I press Scorching Sands. It takes a lot. Uh, it goes for Nako, sadly. So at this point, I kind of. I don't remember what to do, but I have to kind of stay in. Uh,. But I pressed U turn. The reason I was thinking about staying in was because of rocks. Because I know Pharaoh's is going to have to have rocks. Uh, Volt switch probably in the Pharaoh to get rocks up. Yep. Wish. Yeah. I... <sighs> Looking back at this game, I think there were better plays. But I do go into Moldrace here because I know I can live any hit. Uh, and so there we go. Back up to 69%. Roto comes out on my flamethrower. It doesn't actually do enough. Go out into Umbreon on the Shadow Ball. I remember this. Spadef drop. Honestly, I always get Spadef dropped. I every time. I believe I called it out. I'm like, yeah, that's gonna happen. Uh Go for a protect here on the rocks, which were kind of obvious. 
Okay, I'm gonna put it back in normal mode because I'm like, okay, so toxic happens. I think this is when it's kind of stally. Let me see. There was a part that I think was a little stally. Can't remember when it was though. I'm just gonna let it play. If there's something different that happens here, I'll let you know. But you turned it a lot here. We do get Swamper back to basically full. I'm kind of stacking Umbreon at this point. Kadabra was a good brain. I do threaten it out. And I should have pressed U-turn here. Yeah, I did. Spirit Tomb. So this usually bring uh, uses close combat on Trace Bandit sets, that's why I ra went right out into Spirit Tomb. And now that they're locked into close combat, I have a they have to switch. So I have a free move. I have a free move. Sorry, my dog just came. <laughs> Hi, buddy. Free move. Swampert. Okay. So you Shadow Ball again, which was interesting to me. Because you have so many switch-ins to Earthquake and stuff, so. Uh, but I just use Sucker Punch. I get out Rotom, so it ain't a 6 so. Uh There's still a chance. I believe I remember bringing a Choice Bandit Ready Drug, so that might be the case here. God and the Moltres. We just click Scorching Sands to get rid of this goddamn Incineroar. So Incineroar is gone. We still are at 1%. Uh, sadly though, this does outspeed. Boom, there's two kills. We grassy glided, does not do enough. Uh, yeah, I'm probably not gonna draft the wacky again now that I'm looking at this. It's strong if your opponent doesn't have a grass answer. But there's always a grass answer. <laughs> That's the problem here. Um, but yeah, I'm like, all right, I lost. So here, I do want to pause. So here, I was thinking, what can hit everything and potentially win? Um, I had a rock move, which doesn't really hit. Well, it hits him on top, actually. It, rock move wouldn't have been bad, actually. I'm thinking about it. But then I had the risk misses again. Plus, Sloking's at full. So I was thinking, well, Sloking is probably coming out here. I don't see Pharaoh's Sea necessarily coming out right here. Uh, but it does have Fire Punch. It does have Thunder Punch. Uh, it has a Punch Moves, so which, are, which is really good. So, Silken comes out. Uh, boom. Thunder Punch is 63%. Now here, I feel like... I mean, he didn't need to worry about Differential, I don't think. Because uh, he won anyways. Uh, but... If you wanted to preserve the Floro, you just go right in the Ferris Seed and like seed up and then just spam and stuff. But uh, I use Thunder Punch again, obviously that kills. And yep, Ferris Seed comes out. Now, if I wasn't banded, if I was like, maybe not Life Orb, if I was like Expert Belt, uh, I would be able to use Fire Punch here, do a ton. Man, I really should have been expert belt now I'm looking at it, but that's okay. Thunder Punch, I'm basically hoping for the para, but that does not happen as you see. Uh, they do use knockoff though, which was kind of good for me, obviously. Uh, I was able to do 53% min to Fire Punch with Fire Punch, uh, but sadly, that didn't matter in the end. Uh, still, still pretty good game. Um, GG is to Chungus. Again, I mean, you're already one game in into playoffs. You're up to your second game. I believe you were... Are you playing today? You might be playing today. I don't know. Uh, but, yeah. Uh, good luck in playoffs. And, um... Yeah. Hope you get the finals. Uh, I've been watching your games and stuff. They've been fun to watch. And, uh... Yeah, I, I guess... See you all next time. Uh, I do have 
a little bit more free time with videos now though so maybe i will do some oh, i did promise you guys low tier legends so i'll do some low tier legends i also might be doing another league at least the team breakdown uh no hints but probably after this goes up maybe the day after or a few hours after whatever i'm probably gonna do it right after this but yeah i will see you guys uh maybe next season probably next season hopefully uh but yeah guys peace